Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss the problem of linear algebra from CSI NIT December 2017. Example number 30 from booklet A which is of marks 3. Let matrix A is equal to 0, 1, minus 1, 1 then the smallest positive integer n such that A power n is equal to i is so n is equal to 1 first option n is equal to 2 second option n is equal to 4 third option n is equal to 6 fourth option now to solve this example we will use one important result of eigenvalue if the eigenvalue of a is lambda corresponding to an eigenvector x then the eigenvalue of a power n is lambda power n corresponding to an eigenvector x that means the eigenvalue of a is lambda then eigenvalue of a power n is lambda power n now first we are going to calculate the eigenvalue of matrix a so which is a root of characteristic equation determined a minus lambda i equal to 0 subtract lambda from the diagonal entries of matrix a so 0 minus lambda 1 minus lambda therefore we have minus lambda 1 minus 1 1 minus lambda equal to 0 Therefore, the corresponding characteristic equation lambda square minus lambda plus 1 equal to 0. The roots are because it is a quadratic equation. So, we know the method to find the roots of the quadratic equation. This is a delta method minus b plus or minus square root b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. Therefore, we have b equal to minus 1, a is equal to 1 and c is equal to 1. Then we have lambda equal to 1 plus or minus 1 minus 4 is minus 3. So square root of minus 3 is root 3i divided by 2. Therefore we have two values of lambda. Lambda 1 equal to 1 by 2 plus i root 3 by 2. And the second value lambda 2 equal to 1 by 2 minus i root 3 by 2. Suppose for some n a power n is equal to i that means nth power is identity matrix and the eigenvalues of identity matrix are 1 therefore lambda power n should be 1 so we try to find the power of lambda 1 and lambda 2 which will give lambda power n equal to 1 and lambda power 2 equal to 1. So this complex number we write in the exponential form or polar form then we have 1 by 2 equal to cos pi by 3 plus i times sin pi by 3 equal to root 3 by 2. Similarly lambda 2 equal to cos minus pi by 3 plus i sin minus pi by 3. So exponential form is e power i pi by 3 and lambda 2 equal to e power minus i pi by 3. Now find the power of lambda 1 lambda 2 which will give lambda 1 power n and lambda 2 power n equal to 1 and one can easily say that it is 6 so lambda 1 power 6 is equal to e power i pi by 3 6 which is equal to so e power i 2 pi and for lambda 2 it is e power i minus 2 pi and both have the value 1 therefore we can say that n is equal to 6 will give a power n equal to i therefore the fourth option equal to 6 is correct answer thanks for watching for more videos, like, share, subscribe, press the bell icon of next gen mess.